it over there. Well, some sure. of the best dishes on Back Bay will be on display this Friday. It's time for the taste of Back Bay. Yeah, you probably couldn't help but notice Karen and I are wearing lace, so that's kind of the <laughs> Yeah, don't theme. we look festive? It's a little Hawaiian, <laughs> a little tropical. <laughs> and here with us, Sissy Andrews, Executive Director of the D'Iberville St. Martin Chamber of Commerce. And we have Ling Birch and uh, Dave Melton from Rockin' Chicken and Waffles, a fabulous restaurant here on the coast. <coughs> oh, shoot, Karen. Uh, <laughs> Sissy, tell us a little bit about uh, this event that's coming up. Well, Taste of the Bay is a tradition that uh, the D'Iberville St. Martin Chamber has been doing now for 10 years. And it is a fundraiser for us, and the money goes toward the scholarships that we give to seniors that are in the D'Iberville High School and the St. Martin High School. And we choose one from each school, and they get a $1,500 scholarship. So. Oh, that's fantastic. So great food, a great cause. And Ling, what are you working on there today? Oh, well, I'm going to have a dessert. Oh, she's today. going to do the whipped cream. Strawberry, <laughs> blueberry, and of course, whipped cream. Yeah. Oh, well, that's always fun. <laughs> and, of course, we can put some caramel sauce. On well, that's food. a good combination. No yeah, it's all diet free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't worry about we it, right? I know, we right? Have diet -free syrup. <laughs> we do have syrup. Or sugar free syrup. <laughs> now, what do you have, Dave, over there? You've got, I've got something these completely are wraps. different. These are wraps. We have to have a healthy option at some point, you <laughs> know, uh, because we're serving so much fried chicken. But here's our wraps. Oh. Oh, that's yeah. pretty. Grilled chicken wrap. Grilled that chicken nice. wrap. It's like it has a lot of spinach or some kind of greenery in there. Yeah. It's, a, it's a, a, a spring yeah. mix Yeah, that looks is what nice. it is. Now, Sissy, I don't know on your first answer, I, I don't recall really you saying, but I mean, uh, what's the deal with the lays and the tropical and everything? How is that going to be presented yes, at this sir. event? Yes, sir. It is tropical themed. We okay. wanted it to be a casual event so you could wear your Hawaiian shirts, your grass skirts, your coconut bras. If I would you have worn to. my grass skirt today <laughs> if I had known I have a grass skirt. You look fabulous in it. Too. He wears it for a special occasion. Yes, Karen, I appreciate it. Only Karen has a picture of that. But, <laughs> and it is tropical themed, like I said, and we are going to have a, a chance to uh, swing in a pinata that Ooh. has two hundred dollars in it. Oh, so wow! I wish you would have brought a little a pinata. more than candy then. That pinata. <laughs> yes, How much fun is I that? Love now you brought along pinata. some other food here. Um, it looks like you have some kind of we have a bacon dessert, burger and a uh, dessert. Yes. Waffle. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you have um, a lot of different varieties of waffles, of course, right. including one with ch fried chicken. You know, on when top did I'm tr Dave? I'm trying out. to remember when the chicken and waffle thing really, really took was like five years ago, six years ago. Where it, it started taking off. Popular? Disney World did it. That's where it started in Magic Kingdom. Really? Oh. Yeah, in Frontierland. Are you sure yeah. about that? You Google. Well, it. My <laughs> sister, well, my sister told me about it. It actually started in New Jersey. You know, year. I mean, probably. But 75 years. Really? Oh, yeah. Huh. Yeah. It's oh, been around. It's and so it's become a southern thing. A lot of people yeah. in the south are doing You could wear your grass skirt and eat chicken on And we can take the, yeah, the And the dance chicken. on the table. Yeah, we can dip it in whatever sauce you want. And where's Rockin' Chicken and Waffles again? It's uh, 4020 Pops Ferry Road. Okay, easy in to In Diaberville, Mississippi. It's at the very end of the original Pops Ferry Road. Okay, well that's okay. easy to find. Now Taste of Back Bay is um, going to be fun for a lot of people. When's it all happening? It is this Friday night. The doors open at 530 and it's at the D'Iberville Community Center. Okay, and good. people are again encouraged to dress in a Hawaiian shirt yeah. or you yeah. can wear there are all the particulars right there by the way the community center as mm -hmm. Sissy said 530 to 8 you see the price per couple and per person and it's a great way to spend a Friday night. Yeah, it sure <laughs> looks like it. Will you all be wearing these? Yes, yes ma'am. When you walk in the door, you get one of these. We have all different colors. They're so. very pretty. Yeah. Well, Dave, Ling, Sissy, good to see both all Heard three of you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for having us. Uh, Thank you very much for having yeah, great to have you on the show, and thanks for bringing all this delicious-looking food. Well, I'll tell you what, that wraps up this afternoon's edition of the 4 o'clock show. We'll see you back here at 5.